would like to welcome you all to Rhetoric Lab of Salmania weekly meeting. Special welcome to our guest speaker for today, His Excellency, Ambassador of Federal Republic of Germany to Bahrain, Mr. Kai uh, Buchmann. I would like to welcome as well the Egyptian Ambassador, uh, Mr. Um, His Excellency Yasser Shaban. I would like to welcome as well Bahrain Ambassador uh, to Germany, Mr. Uh, His Excellency Abdullah Abdullahi. Uh, dear President Amira, dear members of the Rotary Club Salmania, uh, Your Excellency Ambassador Yasser Shaban, uh, dear friends, uh, for me it is uh, great, um, especially in these COVID times, to see so many uh, friends, uh, dear friends uh, today. And uh, it is a great honor and privilege also to be here with you today, only three days before the celebration of the Day of German Unity, Germany's national holiday and uh, the happiest day in our history. So I will uh, actually talk about uh, two things uh, today. I was asked um, to nominate a topic and I nominated two. One is the what unification means, lessons uh, of history from German unification. And the other is a topic more for the future, the chances which are offered by recent developments for Bahraini German cooperation, especially for in the fields of uh, professional qualifications and study. And I'm, I will, in a way, try to combine both topics. So I hope there's something for, for everyone. If we look at the map, Europe today looks completely different from 1989. The former Eastern and Central European countries are now members of the European Union. And our European continent, which once was the front line for a potential confrontation of superpowers, became the most peaceful and prosperous continent in the world. So if today I look to some regions in the world where neighbors are divided by mistrust and sometimes fear of each other, I remain confident that such divisions are man-made and can be overcome. And as Germany now holds the rotating presidency of the European Union in this semester, we are tackling many challenges. Uh, first of all, COVID-19, Brexit, I mentioned climate change and uh, various crises in Europe's neighborhood, migration. Only together, only in solidarity can these problems be solved. International cooperation, diplomacy, and multilateralism are the keys to resolve many problems. The Kingdom of Bahrain, under the leadership of His Majesty King Hamad bin Isa Al Khalifa, has taken important steps towards peace in the region. These steps were warmly welcomed by Germany. Unification in German history can mean for us, it is most of all inspiration, and it shows that uh, problems and differences can be overcome if there is a will and also if conditions are right. Sometimes it takes a historic window of opportunity to move things forward and maybe we are seeing such a window of opportunity now moving forward um, in the region uh, of the Middle East. Uh, Germany stands ready to support uh, all partners. One of the things I would like to thank the ambassador of Germany for being very helpful, honestly, because I think uh, we have seen, despite the challenges that we have about the COVID, we had a number of uh, patients who were uh, supposed to come to Germany and we postponed some of them in March, April, May, but after that, Honestly, the, the embassy was very helpful to facilitate and provide medical visa or people who have a tourist visa, some kind of documents that would help them to arrive smoothly to Germany, to any city in, uh, in Germany. I've seen the result of how Germany have dealt with the COVID-19. If you compare Germany today to any other uh, of their neighboring countries in Europe, you find number of deaths, number of the uh, people who have been treated as much, much better than any other countries in Europe. We have a surprise for you today. Uh, the surprise is you have a very dear friend to you, Maestro Babylos. 
Hello to everybody. Hello. I'm uh, greeting you from Germany. Uh, to me, it is an honor to be with you today. And uh, you know, this trip in the Bahrain, it's going to be very unforgettable to me because, uh, you know, I made a lot of concert trips around the world, but uh, I think it was the first time that I made immediately friends when I was in Bahrain. Now, I'm going to play uh, just the beginning of a piece by Franz Schubert. And this piece, uh, I, I tell you very shortly, this piece is talking about a better world without sickness, without death. So, you know, uh, these great thoughts have made this classical music so great. So okay. just enjoy a little bit of Franz Schubert. Great. Thank you. 